Welcome back, little beans. Warning. The following ASMR is only aimed for beans who are in need for comfort and positive energy from a favorite cartoon character. There won't be any NSFW versions of this ASMR. This is for all ages and is appropriate for all. However, if you feel uncomfortable from videos like this, then click off. To the ones who are staying, go right ahead and get all cozy in your blankies, pop in your headphones, snack on some cheesy poops. Also, a little trigger warning, there will be swearing and a little bit offensive jokes because due to Eric Cartman. I hope you all understand. Anyways, go in down to South Park and enjoy this ASMR. Hey dude, what's up? Uh, nothing much, Kyle. Just, you know, the usual. Hey, have you seen Kenny lately? No, I think he's still sick. Hmm. I, I do hope he does come back because this might be his third day today and I think Mr. Garrison is gonna give him detention or... I don't know. Possibly. I don't know what he'll do. It's Mr. Garrison. We don't even know what the fuck he's gonna do. Yeah, I agree. How about fat ass? Uh, I do hope he doesn't come because, um, I, you know when it comes to him, it's always... You know, shenanigans that always comes out of him. I hope it's nothing too bad. Yeah. Hey, guys. Oh, hey, Eric. Hey, fat ass. Hey! Why are you calling me fat, you Jew? Oh, speaking of that, have you guys heard about the new student? I heard she's a girl. Oh, and I heard she's part of our grade, too. No way! And another thing is, I heard she's really rich. Really? Another rich kid? I bet she's either black or another Jew because, you know, rich people are Jewish too. Maybe she can be richer than Token because it doesn't, I don't know what, what, what color she's going to be or race, but she's got to be a Jew. Well, shut the fuck up, Cartman! Hey! <laughs> oh, hey, Kenny! Hey, have you heard about the news of the new girl? No, I haven't. Where is she? She's supposed to appear maybe in the next, uh, I guess when school starts. Yeah. Wait, hold on. That, that could be her. She doesn't look like a Jew. Shut up! I'm just gonna say, maybe, not only that she has brown hair or brown eyes, because, you know, Jews usually have brown hair, and yeah, maybe the way she talks, or maybe... She does have a rich money. I don't know. She could be Jewish, Kyle. Shut up, fat ass. Hey! <laughs> Shut up, Kenny! Oh, she's coming this way. Hi there. Hi. Hello. Are you a Jew? Cartman! Just asking, Kyle! Sorry about our two friends. Um, my name's Stan, and this is Kyle. Hello, nice to meet you. And that's Eric Cartman. He's just a fat ass. Hey! I'm not fat! I'm Big Bone. Huh? Who's that guy over there? Oh, uh, Kenny, you want to introduce yourself? Huh? Oh! Uh, hey, my name's Kenny. Oh, uh, you, you look really cute. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, uh, you want to ask me a question? Okay. Dude, no fucking way. What is it, Eric? It's like a dynamic between a poor kid and a rich kid. I think Kenny is a gold digger. Shut up, fat ass. Let's just head to class. Yeah, I don't want to be late. I'm just saying, guys. Maybe Kenny is going after listeners' money because she could be a rich Jew. You don't even know that she is Jewish. I can sense it. I can smell it. I got a taster. Get Cartman! Just saying, Kyle! Anyways, let's just go. Have you seen Kenny anywhere? I think he's still hanging out with that listener girl. Hmm, I guess he just made a new friend or just showing her around. Maybe. Or they're having lunch together. You know what? I feel very proud of Kenny. You know, befriending some new people and getting along with new students. 
It's kind of rare for him to do. Maybe there could be other purpose. Don't believe in Cartman. You know he's just lying and just, you know, fucking things around. No, maybe he... <laughs> I'd say he can either have a crush on the girl. I mean, she is really cute. Yeah. Let's just leave them be for now, all right? All right. <gasps> guys! Guys! What do you want, fat ass? I got, I found some theories that this is actually true, that the reason why C Kenny could be a gold digger. Shut up, fat ass. You just want to make Kenny feel more miserable. No, no, you guys. Okay, um, there is proof that you know how women, you know, they, they go after men that are rich. Yeah. It's because they are so ugly and poor, they have to choose someone that has a lot of money and really good looking. And that's pretty much what a listener is. Are you saying she's ugly? Shut up, Kyle! It, it could be true. Kenny is a gold digger for a listener because he's after her money. Or he has a crush on her because she seems like a really nice girl. Anyways, I'm hungry. You're always hungry, fat ass. Hey! <laughs> oh, you're really funny. Huh? Uh, okay. Yeah, I can take it off. So I am going to take it though. Okay. <sighs> oh, that actually felt a lot better. Anyways, I'm actually glad you actually came here down to South Park. Don't worry, it is really nice down here. Actually, it does go through a lot of bullshit, but... Hey, welcome to South Park. <laughs> I mean, I wasn't expecting your parents to actually come here, too. I mean, finally meeting you really does change things up a bit. And I gotta say, you are really cute in person. And you are right. <laughs> Usually I thought you'd be a, a catfish, you know, one of those creeps that, you know, prey on children and pretend that they are the kid... But hey, at least I believe you. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll, I'll get to show you everywhere. Not just the school, but maybe where I live too, because... Yeah, I actually am poor. You won't judge me just because I'm poor, right? Okay. Uh, yeah. I think you're, you're really gonna love my sister, Karen. She's pretty much... She's she's a she's a total sweetheart and she's gonna love you too. Not pretty much my parents because um they're both alcoholics and they don't want to work. Heck, I, I even had a few part time jobs. Um I have been working at Shitty Walk and kinda of build up some money. It's not a lot. So we can do some shopping and I can get you some gifts. Oh, speaking of gifts, uh I know it's not that much, but uh here you go. I remember you told me you like Little's Pet Shop, so I just got you, like, uh, two little pets. It's, uh, I think that's a bunny, and I think that's a guinea pig. I don't know, but it was like the last ones that I've seen because there was a lot of little girls getting some too, so... Yeah. <laughs> Aw, no problem. <laughs> At least I know anything, everything about you. <laughs> You got me something, too? Aw, listener, you shouldn't have. Usually I never get that many gifts because I'm poor. And sadly, Karen sometimes steal it or my parents destroy them while they're drunk. Yeah, sometimes my, I wouldn't call him a friend, but Eric Cartman, you know, the, the fat boy that called you a Jew. Yeah, um, he takes stuff from me as well. Yeah, I, I just don't do much about it. Anyway, what did you give me? <gasps> no way! You got me a Nintendo Switch? Even Kyle has one too, and Stan. That means I can play some games with them too. I can play that new Legend of Zelda game. <sighs> oh, I love Zelda. Hmm? Wait. What do you mean? Yeah, you told me you have cosplays of Link and Zelda. You brought them with you? <laughs> Can I be Princess Zelda? 
I, I, I know it's weird for me to say that. It's just sometimes I make a, I make a beautiful girl. I even call myself Princess Kenny. And yeah, me and my friends like to do dress up. And yeah, I'm like the princess because I'm so pretty. <laughs> Maybe I can try it on and you can see why. You'd be my sweet little Link. <laughs> I can't wait to see you as Link. We can do those cute little role plays, but not online, you know. I mean, <laughs> I know we do some spicy role plays, but uh, maybe we can make it happen. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Only if you're ready for that. Uh, I'm a little nervous. Yeah, if you hear my friends calling me, you know, when it comes to uh, that sort of stuff... I kind of got over that phase. I guess it's not all about boobs. I mean, it's more than boobs. It's what's in between the boobs. You know what I'm talking about. Your heart. <laughs> Anyways, uh, thank you so much. I can't wait to play it. I do hope Eric doesn't take it away from me or my parents breaking it. I'll keep it safe. So, I was thinking after school, um... Wait, what? Oh, you and your family are still packing. I hope they don't mind, you know, if I visit. Right? Okay, I can help you unpack. I can't wait to meet them. You did tell me they are pretty strict when it comes to boys, so... It's okay, I'm not really that bad. I hope they don't have anything against poor people, because I've always been neglected or treated like trash. Well, what a relief. Hey, seriously, I wanted to say thank you for coming down here. You really do make me happy, and I'm glad I get to see you in person and not on the internet. Of course. And one more gift. Um, before class starts. Um, can I kiss you? <laughs> I know, uh, it's just, I've, ever since I started talking to you, I just, I'm starting to feel very comfortable, and only if you want to. I'm not, I don't want to force you, it's just, I would really like to have my first kiss with you. Yeah? Well, fuck her up, baby cheeks. <laughs> hey, dude! Uh, 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 Kyle! Stan! Uh, what are you doing? Oh, we just wanted to check up on you, see how you two are doing. Uh, Kenny, were you trying to, uh... Uh, she just got something on her face. Uh, that's it. I was right! You are a gold digger, Kenny. You just had to admit it. You tried to kiss her just to get one of her monies. I'm not a gold digger. You're a gold digger, Fetus. Hey! I'm no gold digger! I'm a... Screw you guys! I'm going home. But it's the middle of school. Screw you guys. No. Home. Well, at least he'll be gone for P.E. Oh, yeah, it's dodgeball. All right, we leave you guys alone. Class is going to start in the next 10 minutes. See you at recess. Bye-bye. Uh, you still want that kiss? Maybe behind a bush. Oh. Okay, only when you're ready. That is completely understandable. Um, hey, you want to play some tetherball? Or hopscotch? Or go to the swing sets? Okay, uh, I'll walk you down there. It's not that far. Come on. <laughs>